Yeah. This thing just fell out of the air, bro. Heat resistant metal armor. Vital elixir. Permanently rate. Extremely valuable elixir that permanently raises health when consumed. Crude oil. This reminds me of Ark, dude. Hypersphere. Pendant of diligence. Now I gotta remember how to play. Okay. Pog indeed, dude. But what I'm most interested in is the new zone, the new the new pals, the new everything. So how do I get Oh it's right here. Look at this. I've already got some bit uncovered because I flew over the ocean here. Uh let's go back to my base real quick. I'll show off my uh health. Dude, you can join. You can join my uh, my server too, if you want to. But this is my base. I was a beta tester for this game for the raids. What? And I'll show you my breeding area upstairs. There's something right there. So you might look they added more more boxes, bro. They doubled the boxes. Now there's 30 like Pokemon. And Bella Noir. She's the new she's the new pal from the raid. She's actually really cool, dude. She shoots off like fucking Kamehameha's and stuff. She makes medicine. So You see it, did you? Yeah, dude. This dude, I was in beta, right, <clears throat> with a bunch of beta testers, and these guys are like die-hard Pal World fans, right? And I'm in there, like, I like Pal World, but the only reason I'm there is to like make a video early and post it early, you know. But I actually wanted to make Pal World better, so here I am testing it in hard mode because I played the whole game in hard mode till the end of the game, and the end of the game. There's one boss, I think he's like this one here. He's like the highest level boss in the game. He's nearly impossible to beat. Like I have like, you know, rare stuff. I don't have the, the legendary rocket launcher yet. I've been trying to get it forever. But like you need that. And the guys, so the guys testing the game, they had three, they had three of these on. They had like all legendary stuff. They had everything turned on easy mode. And then they would solo it. <laughs> with uh, with an attack build, just shooting it with rockets, and he said, "Oh yeah, it's balanced." I was like, "Bro, you're exploiting the game and saying that it's balanced. It's not balanced. It wouldn't be balanced if you didn't do that, right?" <laughs> and uh, this update that just came out, they added another ex accessory slot, and now they made it so you can only have one attack pendant, right, instead of three. So now they're all fucked, right? So I thought that was pretty funny. Let's check out this new island. So I told them. Uh, so I told the devs that it would be it's too hard, right? For solo players. They put up a poll and asked everybody, and it was like 60% of the people thought it was balanced or something like that. And like 40% thought it wasn't. And uh they just kept it the way it was. And then the game pretty much died. Because all the solo players were like, fuck this, right? <laughs> Which is like probably most of their players. <laughs> There's literally like 17,000 people playing this game. They, have, they sold 2 million copies. Like at a time. I'd say now it's like probably like way higher though, because the update.
So anyway, I got pissed off when I left the beta test. Because they took down my ticket. One of the moderators there. It's not even a dev. It's just like a random moderator they put in charge, right? It's really annoying. Let's go. Ice Wind Island. Level 5? Oh. This is not the new island. There's a boss too, huh? Yeah, I had like a 15 hour stream yesterday trying to beat that boss. Because I had to get to the point where I could fight him and then I had to fight him for like 12 hours. Oh, there's mushrooms everywhere. Can you harvest them? Grimtail. Whoa, Kojiro. What the hell is that? Oh, it's the frog guy. We gotta catch one of them. Oh my god, he's blowing the shit out of me. <laughs> I forgot how to play. Okay, let's try a hyper spear. We're gonna need a legendary spear. I did way too much damage, it's okay. Do the shit right out of them. They have pal fluids? Hmm, interesting. Dude, I like this biome. This is cool. This is really cool. It's supposed to be like Japanese, I think. Oh shit. You can also increase your capture chance now, too. There's a new level cap and stuff. Those who disgrace the honor of the herd are forced to take their own life by piercing their inflated vocal stack with a tree branch. <laughs> what the fuck? Did I just read? Oh, look at this. Mimag. Daisy Moo. Daisy Moo. Shroomer. Those who disgrace the honor of the herd are forced to take their own life by piercing their inflated vocal sacs with a tree branch. They are blown away into the atmosphere and returned to the afterlife. <laughs> oh, he has leap stance when activated. <laughs> oh shit! He tried to kill me. Get out of here, Crojiros. Return to the afterlife with ye. Wait, okay, so pile deck. Leap stance. When activated, Crojero swells its abdomen and channels its loyalty to build up energy. Climbing on top will propel the player high into the air. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. That's pretty cool. Whoa, what's this? There's a grin tail inside there. Oh, there's like little, like little buildings you can loot. That's pretty cool. Did you see the road? Oh, Shroomer. Dude, in the ro road map, they're gonna have arena PvP. Oh my god, this physics is insane. Apparently they fixed the building and stuff too. It wasn't that bad to begin with, but apparently it's a lot smoother now.
and you can breed alpha pals. Okay, let's see what this one says. Inhaling large amounts of its spores will put you into a trance. Sometimes it's if Shroomer appears motionless, it's not because it's mimicking a mushroom, but rather because it's high off its own spores. <laughs> Swooshy spores can be ridden. While at a base, its mysterious spores slow the rate at which the sand value of all allies in the base decreases. So that's the sanity value. So it keeps everybody sane by keeping them high, I guess. That's pretty cool. Would be really useful, actually. Lift monk energy. Oh, we got a red chest here. Uh, let's discard some of this stuff. You can have your pals sort everything too now. Relaxerus. What kind of stone is this? Wait, I have a... I thought I had a pickaxe here somewhere. I was just swinging it around. He should be able to farm it. Dude, he's level 48. That's crazy. I'm stuck in a tree. Things so slow. Alright. <laughs> we gotta get our shit back. Our spells. There's another one over there. Dude. I didn't know you could aim in like that. Lydium fragments, okay. What? That makes sense. Shroomers. Ooh. Huge bird and leg. Oh, look, it's Vixen Dox. Vixen. Oh, he's level 51? It goes above 50? Oh my god. Wait, is there new tech trees? Oh my god, large power generator. Lock picking tool. Let's say you're getting keys. Sulfur mine, coal mine, that's huge. Missile ammo, light. Weight plaz steel armor, ultra shield, grenade launcher, flamethrower, refrigerated crusher, hyperglider, cold food boxes, laser rifle. Oh, dude, we just hit the tech era. What the hell? Crude oil extractor. <gasps> it's Bushy Knock. I bet he's good fire and dark. Wow. 
He's gonna be a dick though. Yeah, it's a crazy thing. And now I'm baby. On hard mode, you have to be ready. Like when he jumps out, he's gonna start using moves right away. You gotta be ready to dodge or he'll one shot you. But this is not hard mode, I don't think. I think I gotta turn down. Flame organs. I don't need half this shit. Where did he go? Quivern. Whoa, shroomer knock. It's grass and dark. I bet the arena fights would be so insane in this game. Oh shit. Mysterious mushroom. Mushrooms are not suited for eating raw. Eating one make eating makes one prone to feeling hungry. The abundance of spores released by this pal blocks out sunlight. Sometimes if shroom or knock appears motionless, it's not because it's mimicking a mushroom, but rather because its own spores don't let it see anything. <laughs> It's got the same effect as the other one. Sakurajima Northern Rockfield. Oh, that thing locks. Dark and lightning. Kit Kit. They're armadillos. Wait, there's a there's a thing over here, fast travel point. And I gotta use the bathroom real quick. I'm busting. You're back. All right, we're back. Those are the Lux things. Try to get this Kit Kat. The key kit. Don't die. Oh, look at this thing. 
A decade ago, key kit soccer was popular. However, it quickly fell out of favor due to the fierce opposition from the Free Power Alliance. Nevertheless, key kits themselves didn't mind it because it helped shed their old carpus. So it says, rolling full oil partner skill. While in team, key kit helps carry supplies, decreasing the weight of crude oil in the player's inventory. That could be useful. I'm going to need a crude oil base. Aha, me mag. I thought it was him. He's a neutral type. I wonder what he does with his partner skills. Dog coins. Oh yeah, dude. Doge coins. Oh, I shouldn't have dropped all that stuff. Dog coins. A mysterious coin. Apparently there are people who collect these. A Mimag will usually have them, but for some reason they cannot be obtained by butchering it. So what does it say about me mugs? There was once a tradition of handing out an award to the person who met their end in the most foolish way. The first award was given for being unaware of me mug opening chests and being bitten to death. <laughs> so partner skill, master of unlocking. When near a treasure chest, me mug can open the chest without using a key. The type of treasure chest can be opened depends on the skill level. That's pretty cool. Oh, menacing Terra. Well, let's get this prickster. Dark and is it ground? Prickster. So, oh, Prickster. Prickster, it has about 5,000 types of poison. Some of them are deadly enough to cause instant death, but all of them are too weak to have any effect. <laughs> I don't get it. Scorpion Sonar. When activated, it can analyze airborne particles and find a dungeon's exit. Interesting. Can I kill Menace thing, I wonder? Moonflower Ganon. Holy shit, they got swords. They're fucking ninjas. Alright, let's try this. He might have a big blueprint in him. Precious Cloud, Ring of Fright. Okay, what the hell is that? I 
accessory that greatly raises carrying capacity. Bring a freight. Gotcha. More importantly, where is Menace staying? He would be back with the other menace thing, yep. The main body is an entity made of energy with nothing inside. It stuffs earth and min minerals into its outer shell, achieving overwhelming mass. Those who are st struck by it can only let out hellish groans. Seal Scorpion, when fighting together, increases players' defense. Electric tiles drop more items when defeated. That's really cool. Yeah, I need one of these Lux guys. No, not Beacon. This guy. Oh, I got some... Genin after me, huh? Yeah, now. One shot of it. He was bad, man. Yeah. Find another one. What the hell? Forth lightning from the depths of hell. That's pretty cool. Calls forth lightning from the depths of hell. While considered a subspecies of Hellzifer, there is a theory that suggests Hellzifer luck struck by lightning from hell will transform into Hellzifer. Can be ridden as a flying man, applies electric damage to players' attacks. There's a new raid boss too. Probably even harder. Diamond rain? I don't need any of this shit. It'd probably be. Oh, I was just going Lightning Strike Blast Cannon. Blast Cannon Dragon Attack. Diamond Rain. With Ice. Okay. Lightning Strike. I think Diamond Rain's a new skill. Oh, well, we got our first dungeon. Cherry Blossom Cave. 52. Highest cave I've ever been on. Alright. 
I'll take a BRB too, real quick. Test, test. All right. We're back. It's a bit laggy. What? I need to turn out. I got... I got, uh... My train's capped at 60. I don't know if that's good or bad. Well, this, dude, this dungeon looks sick. Oh, I'm super laggy, though. Oh, my God. Where's this lag come from? Wix and Knack. So let's see what she does. Who <laughs> she knocked. Its body becomes a blade upon death. To be taken up by the next generation. If the Bushi who inherited it has a weak heart, the voices of the dead will drive it mad. The madness turns it into Bushi Noct that endlessly wanders. Is 
she should be not this right end. Here. Due to its upbringing, it no longer cares about whether its food is cooked enough. This pal stopped worrying about those de those details and just prefers its food to be as sweet as possible. Not on good terms with Catrus Ignis. <laughs> Pretty funny. Now, why am I lagging? Seemingly for no reason. Maybe it's compiling shaders. Dungeon. Oh shit, I went the right way. Oh. What? Yeah, it's only using 62% of my GPU. the way. What? Cave mushroom plants. What? Who's she not? Tear my head off in a second. Large pal soul. Let's get out of here. Ultra Sphere. Is it better? No, blow. to the boss area.
precious bloom. Ah, jeez. What? I no room. What? Heat resistant pile of steel armor schematic. Plasmid reuse lab. Oh my god, I gotta make some room. It's good. Discard. Discard. Diamond. I just get from the second one. Another heat resistant schematic. Another slab. Cool. <sighs> Legendary sphere, altar sphere. I have to go drop some stuff out. What's my health now? complete That's my thing too Build crude oil like tractor. Meteor launcher.
Yeah, we'll do. I'll be over in a second. The hell is this? Suits here. Shiny. God. I want that thing. Dark and fire, holy shit. Seats there. What does it say about him? Oh, he looks cool. Her suits there. Oh, there it is. It was once believed that as the world approaches its end, the flame would weaken. Doomsayers would repeatedly rejoice when the flame began to weaken. But in the end, it turned out to be a prank by suits here, at least for now. Sometimes digs up, digs up bone when it's time to ranch. Wow. Hirosaki's diary. Alright, guys. We're gonna head over. What the hell is this? Yakuma. Alright, well, we'll check this out. Out. We're gonna head over to Slum Cat Stream now. I'm gonna edit some videos. We'll be back later this evening. So. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, share, subscribe, follow, and I'll see you guys soon. And I'm gonna raid. So don't go anywhere. Uh, shit, I know. Uh, reader dashboard. All right, we're heading over to Slumcast Stream. He's trying out Dark Souls for the first time. It should be fun. Uh, let's go. Wait now.